you've probably seen Shilajit going around on TikTok. It's the miracle black goo, all the amazing benefits of it. And there are, it's awesome. Not disparaging it whatsoever. But what most people don't know is that the thing that's likely responsible for all the benefits is the 45 to 65% fulvic acid that is in Shilajit. Let's look at the study, therapeutic potential of fulvic acid in chronic inflammatory diseases and diabetes. It says here, fulvic acid has been used in traditional Indian medicine for roughly 300 years, and the substance they use is shilajit, a tar-like exudate from the Himalayas. It contains about 15 to 20% fulvic acid. I've seen much higher than that, so I guess it depends. Maybe some products have uh, isolated it and increased the fulvic acid content. Either way, that's pretty substantial, whether it's a quarter or half. As per ancient texts, Shilajit can have immune modulation, antioxidant, diuretic, antihypertensive, and hypoglycemic glycemic effects. When applied externally, it is claimed to be an antiseptic and an analgesic. Analgic. <laughs> Fuck that word, man. So it says fulvic acid is shown to reduce histamine, uh, BX, uh, immunoglobulin, E sensitized mast cells, and basophil cells. This information suggests that fulvic acid can have anti-inflammatory and anti-allergy effects. Studies indicate that fulvic acid can act as anti-inflammatory by re reducing the release of pro-inflammatory mediators from cells. And there you have it. That's what fulvic, which you can get a big bottle like this of just straight fulvic acid. You can obviously take the shilajit as well. I do sometimes. This is my go-to. The other thing about fulvic in minerals in the hummock is that it helps repair the gut lining. So it's a potent antioxidant, but it's also really, really helpful for healing your gut. I like to take a swig before meals to kind of get some of that gut acid going uh, and to also protect the gut lining a little bit, get some of those signalers going of like keeping that gut clean, avoiding leaky gut, preparing for the food that is about to be inbound. And as you know, or maybe you don't know, but your immune system is in your gut. You could say most of your health is in your gut. If your gut is in disrepair, you're likely in disrepair. That's funny. I didn't even know do that. So you can get this in the TikTok shop uh, or waffles.co. And I'm the Waffle CEO. I'm calling here. And thanks for watching.